Hello everyone. Welcome to 7. The air in the French Alps was unusually steady on August 15 when Thierry Go pointed his telescope at the Sun and captured a phenomenon rarely seen by amateur astronomers. It's called the Wilson Effect. In astronomy, the Wilson Effect is the perceived depression of a sunspot's umbra, or center, in the Sun's photosphere. The magnitude of the depression is difficult to determine, but may be as large as 1,000 kilometers. The Wilson effect refers to the depressed appearance of sunspots when positioned close to the solar limb. The impression is that sunspots are cavities in the solar photosphere. The reason is that the radiation we observe is coming from deeper layers in the sunspot than in the surrounding photosphere. The detection of this depression by Alexander Wilson dates back to 1769. Scottish astronomer Alexander Wilson discovered the effect in 1769 during Solar Cycle 2. In daily observations, he noticed that sunspots approaching the sun's limb were far reshortened and often appeared to be sunken or depressed in the middle. The sunspot's umbra is lower than the average solar surface with surrounding penumbral filaments dipping down into it, says Ligo. The filaments are visible on the far edge of the bowl, but not on the near edge, highlighting the depression. The Wilson effect has been debated for more than 250 years. Is it real? Some researchers in the 1950s argued that it was a purely psychological effect. Others retorted that observers couldn't be crazy, there was too much photographic evidence. Although the cause of the Wilson effect is still debated, many modern researchers take it at face value, sunspots are shallow depressions. One idea holds that high-pressure systems trapped in the magnetic canopies of sunspots press down on the underlying umbra, creating a dark bowl. Thank you.